anarchists are against forms of centralization because basically what forms of centralization imply is that a small number of people, whether it's one or a handful or a few hundred, are getting to decide for a whole bunch of other people what's right or wrong. And if we really believe that everybody is a distinct and unique person worthy unto themselves and has their own desires and needs, then why do some people have been elevated to somehow better or more expert or smarter or more worthy to be able to make those decisions? Um, if you don't believe that, then you're fine with centralization. But I think at the heart of anarchism, there's this profound, profound faith in everybody as having value. And that in itself goes against what capitalism is saying. I mean, a part of the reason we even think centralization, not we, but the vast majority of humanity, to some degree ends up thinking centralization is both more effective or the right way or somehow natural, is because capitalism functions completely on this idea of taking away the, the inherent worth of everything in the world and the value of every human and every non-human thing in the world. It's suddenly just fodder for some people to do better over others.